Welcome to another Jamie Tries cooking video. In this one, this kitchen novice will be making Bird's original custard for the first time. So the first thing to do is get two tablespoons of sugar, then two tablespoons of the custard powder, and thirdly we fill up this with a pint of plant milk. Now let's take the sugar and custard mix and just mix them together like that with my old friend the whisk. A little bit like the white sauce the other day, we take the milk and then we put a little bit in like that and stir it in like this look it's already gone that very familiar custard color so as I say I'm just adding a little bit of milk at a time while trying to get rid of all the lumps from the from the uh, powder and I've just been informed you see, I normally whisk like that. If I do it like that, like a pen, I can get just a tiny bit more control over it. So now it's time to add that last bit of milk and really bulk it up. And let's just whisk it just a bit more. And I think we can see now I can't see any lumps in there. While I whisk this, um, thank you so much for watching this video. Give us a thumbs up. And uh, also let me know what you're cooking this week as well in the comments below. And uh, don't forget to hit the, the subscribe button as well. Uh, so I think that's pretty much whisked now. Don't you? So let's move this onto four. And while that's heating up, let's just whisk this again. Now obviously I'm aware that this is a little bit of a shortcut way to make custard. Um, you can make custard in many different ways, including with eggs. Um, might try that at another stage, but this felt like halfway between um, the kit playlist and just the regular cooking playlist really because I don't think I know anyone who's never made custard before in this way so seemed like something I should try certainly so if you come over here a moment I'm just a little bit like the white sauce just making sure that there's no clumps or gaps or anything like that in there you'll have to excuse the terminology um, as you can see, the ring is on underneath, so that will start to heat up. I'm sure I shall see some steam very soon. So I've been whisking this for, I don't know, about five or ten minutes, and I think it's starting to thicken up. The consistency of this as I'm whisking it and misting up the lens is getting a little bit tougher. There's a lot more resistance there now i don't know whether you can see it i'm sure seasoned custard makers can see the difference i am still a tiny bit oblivious as to whether this is right or not so i think we're nearly there with it you can see the steam coming off it as i'm whisking here and it's nearly time to serve so let's pour some of this in there. Oh yeah, that looks good. Right, let's, I've got a spoon here just to catch that so that we don't get any on the oven. Let's try that. So this is quite a quick one today, although the whisking uh, seemed to take quite a time, but uh, I think these things do, don't they? So now it's time to try it. Now obviously I've had 
um, custard before. I've even had this brand of custard, uh, but this is the first time that I've made it, and it's lovely and smooth. Um, I nearly neglected some lumps on the bottom, but that is just the right consistency. So what do you have uh, with custard? Um, apple crumble, like I made the other day. Uh, bananas and custard, used to like that as a kid. Uh, do let me know in the comments below. Do try it yourself. Let me know how you get on and I will see you once more for another Jamie Tries cooking video.